What's going on, YouTubers? So today we're going to be doing the unboxing of the figures Neptune. So we'll start by going over my first impressions. Then we'll look at the main features of the phone. And finally, we'll decide whether this phone is worth it. So just to give a quick background, Figures Wireless is a cell phone company owned by a man named Freddie Figures. And I think what sets this company apart is that their network supports all unlocked devices of any brand. And in fact, all figure phones come unlocked, meaning you can use these devices on whichever provider you choose. So the last thing I want to mention before I get into this unboxing is that this particular model, the Figures Neptune, is currently under promotion, where when you make the switch to their service, you actually get the phone for free. So here's the box that the actual phone comes in when you place your order, it just says figures, and it comes with a little bubble wrap to keep the phone safe. And when you open it up, um, these are the different flyers and stuff that you get inside. So like I said, the phone comes unlocked, and um, so this is the SIM card you get. And these are just some promotional flyers. Like I said, you get this phone for free. So, that's that. Then you get a letter. Let's see. Let's see here. Let me read it first, make sure I don't get up. Okay. So, basically it's just showing you that you uh, activated your phone and tells you which plan that you picked, that type of thing. But without showing my address, that's what it looks like. That's what I so, that's all right. this is the box that come in. Here's the back. See, it tells you package contains figures Neptune, pre installed SIM card, USB charger, USB connector, stereo headphone, quick reference guide, and warranty card. So, let's see. this off to the side. Looks like this is the actual phone itself. There's that. Um, you got your three main home buttons, just like a typical phone. Looks like you got a front facing camera, microphone. I think that's for your flash. And let's see here. This is the power button. Let me turn it to the side so you can see. It's the power button and your volume up and down. Let's see. Bottom of the phone. Nothing down here. And to the other side. Nothing on this side either. Let's see, where's the headphone jack? Okay. So here is your headphone jack and we your charger. So it's on the top. Everything's on the top for this phone. And then you look at the back. It just says figures Neptune. And you got your flash and then your camera on the back. Designed by figures, communication, Florida. Okay, let's keep going. So, just some plastic. So, here is the is this headphone. Let's see. It 
this is oh okay this is the charger put this at you got your standard charger um doesn't look like it's the fast charger just a regular android charger there's that um, you get your charging brake that's pretty standard let me open this This is a charging brake. Again, pretty standard. Then, also, I think they mentioned it, but here's the headphones. Comes with Samsung headphones. So, if I can get that clear. There we go. Comes with Samsung headphones. So, that's pretty cool. It's the ones with the little earbuds. So, that's nice. Seems like nowadays you're not getting phones that come with much of anything. Um, we got some stickers. These are some stickers. Um, oh, this is nice again. So, you got a removable battery. And for those of y'all that have phones, whatever battery don't remove, y'all can understand why this is so, such a good thing. It's something that they seem to got away from, but lithium ion battery. 3.8 y'all can see that nothing on this side what else is in here this is this paper this oh okay <laughs> <laughs> this is a user's guide. Um, this is this little piece of paper. We're just gonna file. This is gonna file that to the side. Um, <laughs> here's the manual. Um, so you can go through this. We're gonna go through the phone in detail. So we'll flip that to the side. Now this is different. Okay, so this phone actually comes with a cell phone case. Yeah. It comes with a cell phone case. Now that's different. Hmm. Make sure y'all can see that. Cell phone case. Looks like you just this has adhesive right here. You just stick it right there. And what else we got in here? Oh wow! And it actually came with a, a screen protector. And this thing is sturdy too. So you know how usually the phone just comes with the little, um, the flimsy one that it comes with, you know, but you don't do much with this one, but this one is actually coming with like a harder one. So that's definitely a nice test. So you're getting all of this for free. Um, that's pretty wild. So. I'm gonna go ahead, put the battery in, start it up, and we'll take a uh, trip through the AI. Hey, so now that we're back, I went ahead and installed the battery and just got a chance to tinker with the phone a bit and just familiarize myself with this device. Basically, this is just an entry level cell phone. It's Figures entry level cell phone. They have three more devices in their lineup. There's an there's an F1, there's an F2, Figures F2, and the company just announced earlier this month that they are planning to release a Figures F3, which is going to be the first smartphone to have 5G capability. So let's go ahead and power this thing on and let's see, there it goes. And it takes a little second to power on. So while it's doing that, I will just go through a few of the specs. Uh, first off, this phone comes in gold, black, or white. I have the black version 
which to me looks more silver than black, but to each his own. It's coming with Android 6.0 out the box. That's Marshmallow. For those of for those of y'all, <laughs> and that always catches me off guard. <laughs> Figures. Uh, anyway, yeah. So it comes with uh, Android 6.0 out the box, uh, which is pretty old for Android. But again, this is an entry level cell phone, and you're getting it for free. The battery life uh, should be pretty good. You're getting a 2500 milliamp removable battery. The phone's dimensions are 140.2 millimeters height, 71.7 millimeters wide, and 8.4 millimeters thick. So those are your specs there. It weighs 148 grams. It doesn't feel too heavy in your hand or too light. And you get two. Let me open this thing up. The phone has a capability, and this is true, I believe, on all figure devices, to hold two to hold two different SIM cards. So what that means, as I'm going into these settings here to show you all. What that means is that you can have two different phone numbers with this device. So if you're somebody who, as we go in here, say you've got slot one and then slot two. So if you're somebody who's like a business person and maybe you want to have uh, a business line versus your own personal line, this phone has that capability. As you can see, you got Wi-Fi, display, pretty standard stuff here. Let's come down to about, as I mentioned, it's coming with 6.0, Android 6.0 out the box. The phone, as you can see here, it's got one gig of RAM, so again, it's not the fastest device, but it's entry level. If we go into the camera here, the camera, when you look up the specs for this, it just says it's an HD camera. So it takes HD, it records in HD, and it takes HD photos. So it's not nothing crazy. Um, but somebody getting this phone, you're not getting it for the camera. You're getting it because you're looking for a budget phone. So let's get into the apps here. One thing that I noticed that's different about this device for sure is the apps that it comes with. And in particular, their Figures Health app. So if we click into here, this app is for people who are diabetic. And what it basically is, is a visual daily diabetes management system. Ooh. That's a tongue twister. <laughs> when you, basically when you buy their wireless glucose meter, yes, this company sells uh, glucose meters, you can pair it with this device and it will allow you to better manage your test results. So the other apps, Facebook, Instagram, pretty standard. Mm. Let's get into messaging for those who wanna see the messenger. Here's the keyboard. Let's try to type a message. What should I say? Let's just say, hey, what's up? Okay. So, the type's pretty decent. Um, I don't have big fingers. I don't have fat fingers, so I don't really have too much problems typing, but let me go on landscape mode. What's up? Keyboard is pretty standard. I don't have, I will mention, I don't have 
service turned on this device. I actually have service turned on with another device and I'll have another video where I get into that into more detail. But that is basically the review of this phone. So be on the lookout for my next video as we're gonna review Figures Wireless phone service. This will give you guys a good idea of what it's like to have a phone running off their network. So to the next video, peace out.